If you're new, hit that sub button, like the video, turn on notifications. Now let's get it. Alright, welcome back to another video, and on this video, we're going to be talking about tips to help you get Bankai and Bleach Primera. This list is going to be in order, so it's going to be from top to bottom, uh, like, the least to greatest, or whatever, you know what I mean. Like, it's going to be from top to bottom, meaning that, uh, number one is going to be way more important than number ten. So, without further ado, let's start. Alright, number ten on the list, we have a requirement that you must have Shikai. To get Bankai, you need to have Shikai in this game. Uh, I recommend watch my video on how to get Shikai if you want to get um, your Shikai, but do know that that video is kind of outdated. He increased the requirements to get Shikai on the video. I mean, before the video was made. Well, I mean, after the video was made, my bad. But yeah, that video is outdated, so you're going to have to do more to get Shikai in this game. I can't remember what you have to do, but I talked about it in that video. I think I said, like, uh, kill 50 hollows and then go meditate and kill 50 hollows again or something. Uh, I'm pretty sure to get Shikai now, you probably have to kill like, I don't know, 70 hollows and then go meditate and then keep doing that in that order until you get uh, Shikai. But yeah, that's for number 10. Number 9, we have you must be rank 1 to get Bankai. I'm not 100% sure that you need to be rank 1, but all the people that have, have Bankai now, which is just me and Fate Jota Master, at the time this video is getting recorded, we're the only ones that have Bankai. We're, all, we're both rank 1. I don't know if you need to be rank one to get Bankai, but I'm pretty sure if you go to your your um to your to your spirit world and you're not a high enough rank, you uh, it's gonna tell you to go away and that you need to get stronger. I'm not sure, but I'm pretty sure it is. And if your spirit does tell you that you need to get stronger and you're rank one already, I recommend going to go kill Hollows and then coming back or something. All right, uh, for number eight, for number eight we have take your time and don't rush. To get shit, to get, I mean, to get Bankai, you're gonna have to take your time. Like, if you rush it, you're gonna, you're gonna end up getting yourself killed. And you're not gonna get Bankai if you rush this. This took me, like, three days to get Bankai. I'm pretty sure it was, it was two or three days is what it took me to get Bankai. I played 24-7, that's why I wasn't really recording much videos. But, I was playing 24-7, doing <laughs> everything I had to do to get Bankai. Taking the time to understand everything that my sword was telling me, and... I just ended up getting Bankai. You're gonna have to take your time to get this. It's not something that you can just rush and get. I mean, you can rush, but it's risky. That's that's very risky. You might die a lot. All right, number seven, we have understand that this will take some time to get. It's not easy. Like for Shikai, this is kind of the same thing with number eight. I mean, for Bankai, this is kind of the same thing with number eight. If you don't take your time, you're not gonna get it. <laughs> I mean, you, you you're gonna die. <laughs> you're gonna die. You're gonna rush it, and then you're gonna get killed. Like, this is not easy. This is not something that you can easily do. This is very hard. Getting Bankai is not easy. It's not meant to be easy because when you get Bankai, you get an overpowered buff. It, we don't want everybody in the game running around with Bankai, so it's not easy. You're going to have to take your time. If you don't take your time, you're not going to get Bankai. Well, you will, but it's going to take you longer. Just I recommend taking your time and just reading everything and understanding what you have to do. Number six read what your sword is telling you stop overthinking it what people would do is that when they see the text like it will tell you uh your swordsmanship is lacking go train some more or something when you read that don't overthink it it's literally telling you what to do what to do just go do it like if your text tells you um i don't know get those hollows or something what do you, what, what do you think that means go kill hollows go kill hollows and go uh <laughs> Just go kill hollows, man. <laughs> like, don't overthink what it's telling you to do. If it's telling you to get those hollows, get those hollows. Number five, we have don't risk 2v1. No, the top five on this list is the main important things about this, about getting Monka. These are like the main important things. Number five, we have don't risk 2v1. If you're fighting to uh, to get your Bankai and someone pulls up on you with another person, don't don't even fight it. Don't even fight it. Don't risk it. Don't risk it. Just run away. Don't even risk trying to die. Because if you die, that will fuck you over. Don't die. D don't risk 2v1. Just run. Just run. Trust me. Just run. Because when you go back to your uh when you go back to your thing to go meditate and then go talk to your sword and you're back at stage one, <laughs> you're gonna regret it. Don't risk 2v1. 
Number four, we have if they pop resurrection. If they pop resurrection, just run away. Don't fight it. Just run away. I don't care if they. I'm sure they're gonna call you a runner into Discord, but hey, they called me a runner into Discord and see what happened now. I don't give a fuck. They can go ahead and call you running the Discord, but it won't matter. While they're over there talking their asses off in the Discord, you over there grinding for Bankai. You can just come back and clap their asses. It doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. Don't even don't even care about what anyone in that Discord says. That literally, literally, they're just sitting in there talking more than they play the game. Don't even worry about what anyone in that Discord says. It's completely irrelevant. When you get your Bankai, they ain't gonna be saying that shit. They ain't gonna be saying that. They're just gonna be spamming rigged. All right, number three bring a friend as you see with me when i was getting my bankai i always had at least one person with me in the server to call for backup in case anything got rough usually i had like i don't know black star or someone in the server but yeah that's why you always see me run around with black star a lot if you run around with a friend one it's funner and two it's easier like it's everything is a, it's funner it's just easier like if someone's jumping you you just call your friend to come help you and you just kill them both and then get out of there like bring a friend it's, it's way it's like one of the most important things bring a friend it's the game is funner and it's easier if you bring a friend trust me you want to bring someone with you number two on this list we have don't be afraid to run from a fight if you're fighting and you get low like if it's a 1v1 and you get low just run away don't risk it just run away but remember that if you're running away they will flash blossom you so make sure you're blocking and turning around and blocking but just run away. Surely they're going to call you a runner in Discord. But like I said, that does not fucking matter. Who cares? When you get Bankai, you can come back and clap their asses. It does not matter. Don't be afraid to run from a fight. Please. If you get like, just run away. And then once you see your HP bar green, just reset. Sure. Yeah, it's cowardly. I don't give a fuck, though. If you're, if you're grinding Bankai, you need to stick with that grind on Bankai. Like, you can't be trying to win fights. You have to run away. I'm sorry, but I mean, go ahead and try and fight it. If you if you clutch it, you clutch it. That's good for you. If you don't clutch it, well, uh, good fucking luck. <laughs> Just don't be afraid to run from a fight. Please don't be afraid. All right. We have number one. This is the most important rule on this list. Number one, don't die. Don't die. I can't stress this enough. Do not die die if you die let's say you're at stage three or something like stage three or four and you die and it takes you all the way back to like stage one you're gonna be pissed that happened to star june that happened to black star you you heard how b pissed black star was on that bankai video that's because my friend rengi he has a black zero he zeroed him and it <laughs> he zeroed him and it took him back to stage one he was on like stage three or something and it took him all the way back to stage one he was heated like black star full-on wants to quit this game he like he's pissed about it he doesn't even want to play this game but i can't stress this enough please do not die like just try your hardest not to die because if you die you will get pissed don't die it will take you all the way back to stage one i mean i've died well actually i've died once when i was bonding bankai but it didn't take me back it didn't revert me to stage but i don't know what happened for them i don't know if he made it harder i'm pretty sure he didn't but for them, they got reverted stages. I didn't, somehow. And another thing, if the server crashes, I don't think that affects your Bankai progress. I really don't think it affects it, but I could be wrong. I'm pretty sure it doesn't affect it. So if the server crashes, just don't worry about it. Even if you're in combat and the server crashes, don't worry about it. But yeah. I'm pretty sure if the I'm pretty sure if the server crashes, all your progress in that data is gone and that server is gone anyway. So don't even worry about it if the server crashes. It's probably just gonna revert you back to where before you join that server. That might be a problem because you lost your progress in that server but what i recommend doing is server hopping constantly so you don't lose your progress but please i can't stress this enough please do not die and understand this i want to i want to make a video on how to get bankai well actually no i don't want to make a video on how to get bankai and if i were to make a video on how to get bankai power would just increase the requirements it would make it harder for everyone so this is exactly why i'm only doing tips i'm doing small tips this these are the only tips i can give you to get a uh, bankai because if i were to do it a video that would get nerfed around and no one would be getting bankai and another thing i want to say uh if you want to get biakuya spot uh <laughs> uh you have to get bankai if you want to get biakuya spot par is doing a tournament in the bleach primary discord so make sure you join that it's probably gonna be linked in the description 
There's a tournament for Byakuya specs. You get the Bankai and all that. Uh, you gotta have Bankai to get it. So if you get Bankai from this video helping you, make sure you hit that like button. <laughs> make sure you hit that like button. But yeah. Uh, I think that's it. Um, yeah, just make sure that you don't die. For number one, please just make sure that you don't die. That's the most important thing on this list. I don't care what you do, understand your text, but don't die. All right, so this is the list. 10, make sure you have Shikai. 9, you need to be Rick 1. I don't know if that's 100% true, but I think so. 8, take your time, don't rush. 7, understand that this will take some time to get. This is not easy. 6, read what your sword is telling you. Stop overthinking it. And 5, don't risk 2v1ing. 4, if you pop, if they, if a wrong card pops a resurrection, just run away. 3, bring a friend in case things get rough. 2, don't be afraid to run from a fight. 1, don't die. Every tip, every tip revolves around number 1, don't die. Alright, thank you for watching this video. That's it. Make sure to hit that like button, subscribe, turn on notifications, and hope this video helps you guys. I know it's kind of sloppy, but... I did the best I could. <laughs> uh, yeah, that's it. Like, subscribe, turn on notifications, and I'll see you guys later.